man, I tell you what, we are having some fantastic weather. <laughs> I feel bad for those folks on the East Coast. Yeah, I, boy, and it's, I, you are not going to believe the snowfall mm. totals in really far south. We're not just talking New England. We're talking about from they've got a, a winter storm uh, advisory out for Atlanta. I mean, it's it's cold there right now. Where do you see it? That's a great shot. Looking from San Miguel Mountain towards the west about five minutes ago, the sunset, beautiful, beautiful sunset out there as the clouds stream over. Uh, the top of our fine fair city 67 was our high 67 the average and even the overnight low a little bit warmer than where we should be so we're looking at some pretty nice conditions out there I'd like to tell you there's rain on the way but there really isn't a huge amount we're going to see you know maybe a tenth to a quarter of an inch across San Diego in the next 72 hours here. Here's your highs around the county today. Look at these coastal temperatures. We're upper 60s 69 in Carlsbad and Del Mar 76 in Escondido. 74 in Valley Center, 72 in El Cajon. No wonder why would people come out here and they see this kind of weather in January. They're just like befuddled at uh, how we get anything done out here, but somehow we managed to do that. There's a look from Mount Soledad, 61 in downtown right now. Winds are calm, a beautiful evening out there. The humidity's come up as the onshore flow has been replaced by the uh, storm that's sitting offshore. Looking at the winter weather advisory, all the purple areas on this map here, but what blows me away is look at the winter storm warnings, basically from North Georgia all the way up into the New England states, and we're talking about a massive storm. This thing is packing a punch. It is tapping into some very cold air and the Gulf Stream. 35 in Atlanta, Washington, D.C., 34, along with Nashville, up into Philadelphia, they are also at 34, and so is New York City. So, yeah, look at this thing. It is so the Gulf Stream is the current that runs along the eastern seaboard. It transports very warm water from the Caribbean up along the eastern seaboard. So, evaporation, that moisture is being pulled into this very cold air mass, and it is producing tremendous amounts of snow as it makes its way up the east coast. Not like a true nor'easter, but it could develop into that later on in the week. Here's our area of low pressure. Look at that thing just spinning around out there. And there's all the clouds that are coming up here into Southern California. That is going to give us a chance of some light rain starting late in the day on Monday into Tuesday morning. Then we start to clear out. So temperatures a little below average because of the cloud cover. We see a warm up on Thursday and Friday as high pressure returns over the Great Basin. That will start to warm things up here in San Diego and for that matter, the entire southwestern part of the country. And for the folks in the mountains, you'll also see a chance of some sprinkles on Martin Luther King Jr. holiday. But the deserts, you should stay dry.